Baxter had interacted with the Lillian before, which was what tied them all together. Team members and leaders have included Dr. Long, Blade, Morbius, Magic, Nico, Minoru, Wolverine, Zoe Laveau, Kashala, Dr. Voodoo, Elsa Bloodstone, multiple Ghost Riders, Hannibal King, Hellstrom, Iron Fist, Man Thing, Jennifer Kale, Ben Riley, Victoria Montesi, and Werewolf by Night. So all those supernatural and mystical people. Number eight to Web Warriors. The Web Warriors are a fantastic multiversal team that spotted in the events of Spider-Verse. But even before they existed in the comics, they and the Spider-Verse were inspired by the team-ups of multiversal Spider-Man in the 90s Spider-Man animated series. The Web Warriors were brought together by the multiversal threat of the inheritors who hunted down various alternate spider people known as spider totems across the Marvel multiverse. After they were defeated during the Spider-Verse event and the dust had settled, the Web Warriors were created to defend those worlds who were left afterwards without a hero. Considering how powerful Peter Parker's Spider-Man is, I think you can understand how a team made up of various alternate versions of the character would be off the charts when it comes to their power level. I mean, Spider-Man himself is pretty crazy with a team of Spider-Man. This is an Avengers team that's actually just like different spider people. That could be pretty cool. Number seven, Fantastic Four. The Fantastic Four, despite being often smaller in number, though they have expanded beyond that number over the years, is still mightier, I'd say, than the Avengers. But I also feel like that's to be expected. After all, the FF world. One of the first Marvel teams, and are referred to fondly as Marvel's first family. So if anything, I can see them kind of like the first team. The Fantastic Four usually is made up of the four initial friends and relatives who are forever changed by exposure to cosmic rays during the first voyage out into space. At least that's the original origin story. The team has had countless heroes join their ranks here and there over the years. Well, you know Mr. Fantastic, Invisible Woman, Human Torch, and the thing. Some other members on the FF roster have included the Hulk, Wolverine, Ghost Rider, Spider-Man, Storm, She-Hulk, Nova, Moon Girl, Devil Dinosaur, Crystal, and Black Panther, among others. Number six, The Quiet Council. They aren't really a team of superheroes, but the title of this video is simply Marvel Teams, more powerful than the Avengers, and The Quiet Council, I would consider them to be a team still. They're a team of folks in the Marvel Universe. Granted, their team is more about protecting their power and their nation of Krakoa, but hey, I think it still counts. The Krakoa and Quiet Council, as such, is composed of not just mutant superheroes, but mutant villains as well. As Krakoa is said to be a place for all mutants, where past misdeeds are forgiven in the name of creating a better tomorrow and a safe haven for all mutants. Current members include some of the most prominent, iconic, and powerful mutants in all of existence. Destiny, Hope Summers, Storm, Exodus, Professor X, Frost, Mr. Sinister, Captain Kate Proud, Mystique, and Sebastian Shaw. Formerly, the Council also featured such additional powerhouses as Apocalypse, Magneto, and Jean Grey, besides. Number five, X-Men. I mean, of course I was going to put the X-Men on this list. Y'all know me, I'm a huge mutant fan. And the premier mutant team in the comics, of course, is the X-Men. I've also loved that over the years, the X-Men have become more of a global team than just necessarily an American team. Unlike the Avengers, which has tended to remain mostly American in terms of their prominent team members throughout the years. I mean, most of the people on the Avengers tend to be American. Not always, but I feel like the X-Men is a little bit more global in that regard. Although they do also have a lot of American members. X-Men's current and previous lineup have also been exceptionally strong, and even the OG X-Men roster featured some mutants who are still considered the most powerful even today, and who are still around, of course, in the comics. The current roster features Cyclops, Firestar, Forge, Ultimate, Havoc, Magic, Jean Grey, aka Marvel Girl, and Sync. Honestly, Sync is also a just so amazing, and has taken the meaning of teamwork to another level, I think. Sync.